What kind of false advertisement is this? Hey man, I respect it. You don't want to give away too much. Why does every, like, DK have a warrior? You, you notice that? Every DK player plays warrior. I do notice that. There, I Are think you, it's... Yeah, you're right. Karu, YMCA, Chunky Kong. I think it's... I don't know, I think it's just a character, like... A lot of DKs are really good at playing patient, I guess. Or you'll, like, work that pretty well. Oh my god. That's a gross. Alright, I don't know if, I don't know how I feel. He's kind of in shambles. Oh! Shambles, for sure. Already dropping the first dog. Only putting 27 onto Ashton. I think he's only halfway to his waft, too, so... Yeah. It's not a like, good look. The only way that first dog was solid evil was if he, like, lived long enough to walk on Kimber. Yeah. Yeah, but that is not the case. But, I mean, Chung Kong's putting good numbers on Ash now. I always, like, am looking at that boomerang when it comes back. I feel like, I like that boomerang kills folks more can... often than not. I like how everyone thinks you can punish grounded hero spin. With Youngling, you can't. Not even with the bike. No. Oh <laughs> man! I just does it again. <laughs> so funny. Yeah. All right, the game of Chase the Link continues for Chucky Kong. Like a full stock down still. Yeah, this is rough. Ashton's just playing so evasive, man. Yeah, forget committing. I'm gonna throw projectiles and then land it down there. A down tilt. Just, really just because, like, that's the kind of like, thing about Wario. The minute he, he can have a hard time chasing you down, but once you get in, dude, it's damage city, literally. Like, prepare to get hit by every aerial Wario has. Good back air. Wait a, minute. Wait a minute. Oh yeah, you're right. He's got the blinking red. Hello. Yeah, he can come back, man. He gets an up tilt at the right percent. He's falling he there. Like 40 I mean, Ashton has to recognize one. Like, if he screws up, he just got Oh! Oh! Hey, yeah, we got oh, it. Wrong direction, oh, though. Wrong, wrong direction. direction. Yeah, he pulled too far to the left. I mean, a good percentage at least, but yeah, yeah. I, I think he should have waited. I got that up there. Yeah, but with the, the pace that this game's going, Chunky Kong should have access to at least a half waft uh, in his last stock. Yeah. So, I mean, kills at. Mid percent is still going to be a threat uh, that Ashton has to recognize if Chunky Kong can take the second stock. Oh, he rolled. Remember when Wario's side, oh, side B used to actually be the charge? God. In, in PM? Yeah, Wait, in, no. what game was that? I don't, I don't remember that. In, no, I'm sorry, in Brawl he had a charge. Oh yeah, it was in PM, sorry. I, lo I lost. I lost. I lost my track. I thought I was like, no, it wasn't. It was brawl. I was like, no, it was PM actually. Yeah, I don't remember that. All right, somebody not too far behind. This needs to find like a back here on stage maybe. Oh yeah, right now you're young. <laughs> Getting two hands oh, to kill. Tough. That's that's really like what's costing him. Yeah. Trying to fall in on Ashton. Ashton lands forward or a fire arrow, and then that's another forty. And in certain situations that later presents, like if Link just lands in air in general, <laughs> like you'll lose your stock because it has enough knockback. He's relatively safe, blasting hitbox, saw out of shield, like so. Yeah, yeah, he has to pretend slowly, he has to be careful. This could still be very much Chucky Kong's game. 
Yeah. Damn it, slowly we, losing we grip. Oh, he didn't get the back air one confirmed. Damn, he got sour and dodge the tank. How unfortunate. Oh, call out. Good call out. Yeah. Best case scenario there. Do you even lose that stock? You didn't have to worry about the last one. The last stock. Pretty clean. And uh, you gotta wonder, man. Is it just time to go DK like... <laughs> You know, it was time to go DK 10 minutes ago. But it's also a tough matchup for DK. Like, it's, it's, it's not one that, like, I can tell you DK can do pretty good. DK has a, I mean, it all depends how Chicken Kong plays it, but. I mean, in, we know how Chicken Kong plays it. He plays it like a bully. He plays yeah, like so. a steamroller. He can either steamroll or get steamrolled. That all depends on how Ashen actually handles it. Because it's a tough matchup for DK either way. It sounds like my type of game. Either you steamroll yes, or you get steamrolled. It's DK time. Yes, put on the tie. Let's get to game two. Watch, you're going to see like such a strong start from Chunky Kong now. I mean, this is his best character, so... Even though the matchup's gonna be frustrating, I it's it might as well just give it a try. You know? Yeah, it's worth a shot. Oh, oh, not, not getting the second hit. That's the one that has the launch on it. Yeah, he did. Actually, he uses double jump too, so I might. Have he wanted the grab. That's kind of one of the things you have to do against DK. Is you want to avoid getting grabbed as much as possible. Up air, close. Uh, he hasn't Not grabbed it. yet. He's been going for it a lot. Oh yeah, he got caught. <laughs> so the the reason why it worked last time is because uh, side B has to load in the armor before it can actually get stopped. It has like three frames before it gets armor, and then it gets armor. You mean the up -beat? Yeah. That's why Ashton was able to hit Chunky Kong off of the open burn before. Oh, that would have been good. If you connect to the down tilt, you could do a lot of combos from there. That's what he's looking for. Yeah, nice. Chunky Kong able to escape the corner, getting the trip animation. Still not able to get the the up air after the up throw. I'm starting to think he's only doing that just so he can hit grounded oh, up yep. beat. <laughs> oh, you think you're he's trying to like trap them instead? Yeah. Yeah, it's a little bit of that, I would say. Bro, he's just <laughs> kind of brute forces his way with the Chunky Kong. It's like he hit him from center stage in a position where I was like, why would you do that? But he did it and it worked for him. Hey, do you just carry corner carry your opponent? You just push him and then you punch him. Yeah, that's gonna kill. Dang, even DK died. Though. Yeah, hero hero spin at the ledge is ridiculous from both links. I think there. the aerial one is like has a little bit more confirms to kill with young. Fire arrow. Fire arrow in there. Not good for Chunky Kong. It's a side B uh, to the ledge. A tool that we haven't really seen from Chunky Kong. You usually see him like almost spamming it. I think the only reason why is because like he can get spaced out. I think he does a pretty solid job of punishing Ashton in certain ranges, but like you have the speed, the damage, the projectiles to kind of like keep DK away. It all depends on just how much he's reacting. Okay, taking the trade. Hey, DK is like already at such high percent trades. It's aren't exactly game though. Trade. It's oh, if you kind of did that dong punch, Young Lin could have actually died. It's even game. All oh, close. Nice. I think he's doing a solid job. Up B. Yep, and that's it. Oh, oh I, I'm telling you, man, the back hit. It's not reliable. I think he might have held back. He might have held back to so an overextend. That's what usually happens. You hold back. Yeah, Upper has a lasting hitbox, and that'll do it. He re he read the jump out. Two hundred eleven percent. 211% is what Chunky Kong lost his last log to.
that's quite the heavy character. And like like I said, like he does a really good job of like trying to space spacefully punish Young Link, but when he has the speed and the projectiles to not even be within that certain bubble that DK has, yeah, uh, it's difficult. <laughs> like there's nothing you can really do. He did a really good job of using um the the copter on the ground in certain positions, but like aside from that situation, he didn't really have much going on. I think it, I think Ashen does a really good job of just trying to avoid getting hit by grab and down tilt. That's what you have to be careful with. Yeah, at the same time, you know, Chuck Kong really, really utilizes like falling on top of his opponents, but Ashton yeah. constantly backing away. As anyone should, like, you have to kind of. It sounds like anti what you would treat the DK matchup, especially if you can run him over, but you kind of have to respect him a bit and whiff punish him a little bit more than you would go in. Let me tell you, man, there are some things, DK, where you think you can actually combo him. He just gets away with it with grab or nair. That was overzealous. I like it, though. Actually, now that I think about it, the down B, like, especially in like those ledge positions, covers such a wide area that it should uh, cause a wall for Chunky Kong. I think that's what Ashen is definitely understanding too. A uh, good nair to shield. I think it's like his, I think it's his fastest option. I'm not sure. Ooh, I like it because he thought Chunky might have tried to cross him up at the down air, but good down air on himself. Really moving forward air 120. I mean, it's still even. Chunky could easily take the stock. It wouldn't be too hard. It's all on Ashen to see how he can get, how much percent he can get before he loses it. Yeah, and he lost it. 50% not too bad though. That's a good percent. Oh. Looking for the, the defensive pullback from Ash and Chunky Kong. Really gives up uh, that extra damage that was guaranteed at those low dash attack percents. Yeah. Oh, he really wanted to come in hard with that down B. Once again. Stage now. Okay, nice get up attack. Oh man, he missed the tech, but uh, he wasn't able to really follow up there. And like every hit that uh, Tony Hong gets, like he has to make it count for a lot just because it's so hard to get in on his character. I, I also like the fact that Ashton, wow, that was good. He went with Nair and he knew that Chucky Kong was immediately going to drop shield, so he could try to get a punish for that forward air. Yeah, that was a good bait. Yeah. I think it, uh, you can definitely see it a lot in Ashton's ledge play. Like, he doesn't really commit too hard to the ledge. He keeps a certain distance so that he can punish Chucky Kong. Yeah, go for it again. Same landing trap after missing the cargo up there. Going for the spinning Kong. But yeah, I think Ashton's seen through it now. It's going for it a good, like, three or four times now. I mean, it's worked uh, once or twice. But yeah, that, that trick is definitely uh, played out. Yeah. Good good wall bouncing with the boomerang. Allows him to come back on stage and lead in with a possible corner carry. Because boomerang Ooh. can do that. Oh man, this is really rough for Chunky right now. Oh, oh he, that was smart. He expected the pop-up so he could actually get the up smash, but... No, he didn't get the second hit. Yeah, he did That's it. That's supposed to be guaranteed too. What happened to the second hit? Doesn't matter. He's out of here. <laughs> yep, and Ashton will punch the ticket into the winner side of Grand Finals, while Chunky gets sent to Losers Finals. We'll see uh, Larry gets